So here we are in a snap election in New Brunswick in the fall of 2020. Just two years ago, we had an election and a minority government, a four-way minority government, was chosen by the voters of the province. Ever since then, the mainstream media keeps trying to put it in the old box that we've had for 40 years that it's either red or blue. But that is not the reality. And consider just 18, 20 months worth of working together in a four-way minority, and they were starting to get the hang of it. But all the way through it, mainstream media kept reporting it as the Higgs government. We've gone through one of the toughest periods we've ever experienced with dealing with COVID-19 and the pandemic. New Brunswick has done extremely well, mainly because of the responsibility of the chief medical officer and the staff of people and the team of people that all work together to protect New Brunswickers, but also because there was a four-way minority government. They all worked together with a common agenda to help the province. A four-way minority government got us through this pandemic. And now we're having a provincial election because some within the traditional parties want power instead of governance. And media keep reporting it as the Higgs government, when in fact it wasn't. It was a four-way minority government that had to work together. Please remember this as we go through the next three or four weeks of an election period and media are going to do their best to try to push you, the voter, back into the same old mindset that there's only really two choices. Try to remember as we go through all this that a four-way minority government got us through a pandemic. Imagine what a four-way government could do when pushing us through with the challenges that are coming in the next 15, 20 years. Because the decisions we make now are going to show up about then. Or ask yourself this. Has what's happened in the past 40 years worked for us? Has the 40 years of industrial development, of a cozy relationship between business and government, of the influencers behind the scenes that you never get to vote for, actually the ones that are controlling the province, is that still the method that you want for governing New Brunswick? Or do you start to see your way through seeing a four-way minority government and start to include Indigenous cultures and peoples in the large-scale decision-making to create a better province? Thank <laughs> you.